Let's go to the field. Greg Mosier with Coach Brooks. I am down here on the field with uh, Coach Brooks. And Coach, did you expect BYU to be able to run on you like they did in the first half? Well, we're trying to do some things against their passing game. And uh, the one uh, run that really hurt us, I think, was their touchdown sweep. And uh, we got caught a little bit of sleep. Kearns came out of the game. Tista went in. We didn't get our defense set uh -huh. in time. And they caught us off balance. What are the keys for uh, the Oregon team in the second half to, to hold on to this lead? Well, we've got to do a good job uh, controlling the ball. We need to keep BYU off the field, their uh -huh. offense, and, uh, and get points. We are down there twice, came away empty-handed. Uh, bad hold on the one field goal and uh, you know we go front fourth and don't make it but uh, we just need to make sure that we get uh, uh, points on the board and control the ball and, and we're, we're moving it on the ground and through the air so we just got to keep it up yeah you haven't been stopped best of luck in the second half okay Todd we'll go back up to you in the booth for the second half all righty Greg thank you very much as uh, you heard coach Brooks says he wants his team to continue what they have been doing offensively and why not 381 yards of total offense in the first half and Conversely, uh, the defense has got to find a way to stop BYU and uh, put a little more pressure on Ty Detmer. The Cougars with 300 yards, so a total of 681 yards of offense in the first half alone. That's been